Last week I went to see Oppenheimer. I, I enjoyed it enormously. Now, it's caused offence in India, and there's quite a debate going on because of a scene, um, the end of a sex scene, during which the hero, Oppenheimer, uh, is asked to read a page from the Bhagavad Gita, and he reads, apparently in Sanskrit, I am become death, destroyer of worlds. Now, the context of that has caused offence in some parts of India. But I think really what should be causing offence is the fact that the translation that he provides is a translation uh, that is dependent on a modern interpretation of the Bhagavad Gita. And uh, it doesn't necessarily read that. It could read time. Uh, I have become time. And uh, so I don't think... I don't think Oppenheimer was reading the Sanskrit. I think he was reading a translation. And he's not supposed to have said that uh, I have become death, the destroyer of worlds, until uh, until he, um, and, and, and until the bomb had taken place until 1945. So I, I, I think Indian film fans, Indian film fans have good reason to be critical, but not, not the reason that um, that uh, that that is being cited by the Indian government. Uh, the, um, the, the, the there's a fellow called Uday who's um, from the uh, government central information commission has written an open letter on Twitter complaining about the director Christopher Nolan. This is Oppenheimer's disturbing attack on Hinduism. Uh, is a, is a direct assault on religious beliefs of a billion tolerant Hindus and waging war on the Hindu community. Uh, he demanded that the film's director censor his own work. Um, as I say, I think I think the first thing that should be that should be looked at um, is not that is not the context of that scene, but the the idea that Oppenheimer is reading Sanskrit. And translating and, 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 and doing a simultaneous translation, I just don't think it's credible.